I smelled a little bit of a charge. I felt a tingle on my neck, just like they tell you, and then bam, it hit. And the next thing I woke up with paramedics around me. Lightning strikes happen that fast. And now Arvada, Colorado resident Chad Greenlees knows that firsthand. The month of July sees more thunderstorms than any other month, so it shouldn't come as a surprise that most lightning strikes occur this time of year. Last night's lightning was just so intense, it was, it was constant. For 22 minutes straight, it was pure lightning, pure thunder. Nearly 2,000 people have died from lightning strikes since the U.S. started keeping records in 1940. In the last 30 years, an average of 51 people die from lightning strikes each year. For the last 10 years, that average drops to 33 thanks to outreach and education programs telling people to stay inside. Greenlees was taping the thunderstorm in his garage where he thought he was safe, but his video proves he wasn't. This wasn't a direct hit. Doctors think he either experienced a side flash, sometimes called a fork, as shown in this swell animation from Noah, or it could have been ground current, another high-tech animation, courtesy Noah. Joking aside, lightning strike survivors still experience both short and long-term injuries. I'm okay now, I'm really sore. Um, this ear is really, really ringy. Um, and this right side is just really, really short. Like somebody hit me with a baseball bat. Other problems can include troubles processing new information, multitasking, slow reaction times, chronic pain, depression, and difficulty holding a conversation, just to name a handful. I have a brand new respect for th thunder and lightning and just being safe altogether. The safest place during a thunderstorm? inside. Then wait 30 minutes after you hear the last rumble of thunder because lightning has been known to strike up to 25 miles away from a thunderstorm. If all of us take this advice, then maybe, just maybe, fewer people will be struck by lightning in the years to come. For Storm Shield, I'm meteorologist Jason Meyer.